So most mm -hmm. people would consider money one of the most important things in their lives. But how many people actually understand what money is and how it works? We're at Jekyll Island, Georgia, and something happened here in 1910, which, you know, they say that truth is stranger than fiction. This would make one of the great detective novels of all time. In 1910, some of the world's most powerful men, it's estimated that they actually represented one sixth of the world's wealth. Men secret in Hoboken, New Jersey, and took a train to this beautiful place here in Jekyll Island, Georgia, which was the private club of J.P. Morgan. J.P. Morgan, you may recognize from the name of his company, which is now J.P. Morgan and Chase. He's one of the biggest bankers in the world. This was a real life conspiracy. And these gentlemen came together and they fundamentally altered the banking and monetary system of America. And in my opinion, they actually fundamentally altered the character of America. For instance, did you know that the money in your wallet, we say that the dollar is as good as gold. Did you know it's not actually backed by gold? In fact, it's not backed by anything at all. It's actually backed by debt. And if the government were to pay off all of its debt, there would be no money. Did you know that when the Federal Reserve stimulates the economy by giving the government a bunch of money they can spend, that it actually hurts you by reducing the purchasing power of your money? All that stuff is due to what happened here in this place in 1910 when the plans for the Federal Reserve System were formulated. So if you want to read about a real life detective story and about a conspiracy that still resounding through the world today, I would encourage you to learn about Jekyll Island, Georgia, learn about what happened here and learn about the Federal Reserve System, because I think that's one of the most important issues that we face in America today.